What if I told you that a Roblox update that came out a couple of weeks ago is even more terrible than this selfie that I took last night? I know that sounds impossible, but trust me, it actually is. A seemingly harmless Roblox update is secretly being used to upload complete and uncensored P-word to Roblox games, and I am very genuinely sad that nobody is talking about it. If you're a Roblox moderator, please, for the love of God, put a stop to this and try to get it under control because this is really, really bad. The update that I'm talking about is this thing called Editable images and basically the way it works is it allows you to upload images to Roblox that can be altered by the person playing the game. Here is an example of somebody that made a little puzzle where you can drag around pictures and create uh, an entirely different image out of a bunch of smaller images. Now I'm sure you're starting to see where this is going but trust me it is a lot worse than you might think. And when I first saw this update it looked really really awesome and I mean it kind of still does because people were making stuff that didn't even look like Roblox whatsoever. Like here you have an example of somebody who recreated a Nintendo style game using this brand new Roblox feature. Here's another person that used this feature to make it look like blood was coming down the walls and basically animated it in their game to make it look like it was dripping. So you see all this, it looks really cool, but um, you see there's a massive, massive problem. The way that Roblox actually does this is they make it so that you can actually upload these images without any moderation whatsoever. But only if you do it in a certain way. So the way that an editable image works is basically Roblox allows you to upload an image and uh, well, they did it in a way that lets you upload the image without it being reviewed or moderated in any way, shape or form. And the way to enable this uh, unexpected feature of an editable image is literally as easy as one, two, three. It can be done in a second, and all you have to do is insert a simple line of code into your Roblox client, and you can literally watch P-Word in Roblox games. I'm gonna show you exactly how it works and why it's so terrible. But first, I, I wanna get to the root of this problem, and I wanna talk about something that I think is kind of important. And it all started when I saw Dennis tweet out this guy named VuxFux, who was making some questionable videos on YouTube. Roblox, slap your girlfriend, uh, uh, rating my stepmom's Riz, um, and you're probably sitting there questioning, what does this have to do with what you were just talking about? And, well, here's the thing, you guys. When you have Roblox YouTubers that have 8.3 million subscribers that are making videos that are basically identical to P-Word, I think it goes deeper and it really flips a switch in people's brain that Roblox, a kid's website, can actually be used for P-Word. Because, I mean, look at this. This is quite obviously a thumbnail and title straight out of a P-word video. Like, here's a clip from one of his videos. Just tell me this isn't extremely suggestive. What's going on? I don't need you to watch me, lady. Ava, I appreciate it. I know you're trying to be a good I... mom, but like, no. I'm not interested in this. I'm trying to help you, Jamie. You're just so adorable. Oh, don't you God. come near me. Don't you come near I don't want any, lady. Come on, Bucks. Don't you run from me, big boy. Oh. Nobody likes a scaredy cat. Oh, oh she's gonna... Oh my god! Oh, oh, I can literally feel the brain cells exiting my body through my ears. But just watch that video unironically and tell me that is not part of this entire problem as a whole. And the only reason I bring that up is because I feel like Roblox moderators are probably watching this and I think that's at least something you guys should look into if you actually want to fix this problem. I mean, there's tons of YouTubers just like him that do similar things. But anyway, let me show you just how terrible this whole thing is and how it works. And it all starts with this right here and it may not look like much and that is honestly because it isn't this is literally five words of code that all you have to do is put into your roblox game and it allows you to look at completely uncensored images let me show you just how it works so this right here is a game that uses this new roblox feature editable images it's called base plate one looks totally totally normal right you got the classic thumbnail there but let's load in and see if we see anything interesting well i'm in the game and all you can really see is a giant g UI that is covering your character with a little loading screen right here. Literally nothing in this game except for a base plate. And you're probably like, all right, well, what's wrong with this? It's literally just a normal game, right? Wrong. Extremely, extremely wrong. This is exactly how they hide it because if a Roblox moderator tries to join this game, this is what they're going to see. They're going to let the game be fine. They're going to let the
let the game stay there and nothing is ever going to happen to this. But if you simply open up the Roblox file location on your computer and add a certain line of code, I'm not going to tell you where because I don't want anybody to repeat this because it is actually genuinely disgusting. It'll show you an entirely different image when you join the game. So here's a recording where I did this on a completely different computer because I was a little bit scared. And well, I did that thing with the file where I added the code and well, just watch for yourselves what happens when I play it. And also quick uh, note for my editor. I am so, so genuinely sorry for what you're about to see. Just put a giant pixelation over the entire middle of the screen because oh my God, it's horrible. So I'm on the game page, right? Base plate one, the exact same game, exact same person that made it. I click play and you're going to see something quite a bit different. Now, obviously I'm going to blur it out because it is incredibly disgusting, but the way it works is blur, 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 blur it all out. Oh my God, it's disgusting. So as you saw, there was something entirely different on my screen when all I had to do was insert a tiny, tiny tidbit of code into my Roblox file location. Like, I'm telling you guys, it's not clickbait. You can quite literally watch P-Word in Roblox games. And the bad thing is that people are literally doing this right now to exchange P-Word with each other in a very secret way. And the worst part is that they're doing it on a kid's website. They're doing it on a website that is literally crawling with children. It's horrible. And it just, it literally just makes my blood boil. It's so gross. Like, I'm genuinely begging you, Roblox moderators, please please, please take care of this. It's horrible. But if you guys think that's bad, just wait until you see what else I found. It's, it kind of gets a little bit worse. So the game right here, base plate one, that looks completely normal. Um, if you actually go to the person who made it, it takes you down an entirely different rabbit hole that is just sickening as well. So here's his profile. You scroll down here. He's in a group called Funny Shirt Gang 2. And well, clicking on this, uh, you're going to need some bleach for your eyeballs because inside of this group are terrible, terrible things. So, Funny Shirt Gang 2, huh? Pretty normal looking group, right? No, no. Go to store, you'll see that they actually have figured out how to completely bypass Roblox shirts and display P-word on Roblox shirts as well. So they can literally walk around in a Roblox game with a shirt on that is literally a picture of you know what. Like, if you're watching this video, I I, I, I would just report this um, so that people watching the video can't go and buy this shirt. Like, just report all this stuff like oh my god it's so gross but they have matching shirts and when you put both the shirts on at the same time it does exactly what you're thinking it'll make an entirely new image on your chest and well here's another one that you could probably just use your head to fill in the blank of what this means and as i was looking at these shirts i realized there is an entire underground roblox shirt market for um, really, really bad shirts like this one. Now, okay, having a swear word on a t-shirt, I mean, that's not that bad. It's kind of funny, but when you have P word on a t-shirt and you're walking around in a kid's game, I think that's an entirely new level of nastiness and disgustingness. Like, why? I don't understand the process of why you would do that, but listen, I I really genuinely hope that Roblox can take care of this, and I'm, I want more people to talk about this, like more drama channels so that we can get this solved. Like, everybody's talking about stupid stuff on Roblox. Oh, let's talk about stuff that actually affects people and has a negative impact on the website that is genuine and kind of disturbing. So, leave a like if you enjoyed watching this video. It took a while to research this and really dig into it and figure out what was going on. And, uh, listen, if you want more of this stuff, subscribe and watch the two videos on your screen right now. They're both really, really, really good. All right? Yeah, that's about it. Have a good day.